Y'all know how it is when people don't take weight loss as serious as you. You know what I mean? Like, I should have known she wasn't coming. So I got my low carb bread. Now this stuff, see, it must have did something wrong. This is that Aunt Millie's bread. It used to say one net carb, right? I just so happened to look at it recently. They didn't change it. It was a number one on there before. So I got two slices of bread. Now it's like five net carbs. So I'm like, okay, y'all full of it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay. I'm a little tired. I hate having to use these ties, y'all, but when it's fresh, when it's a fresh loaf, I have to. So we're gonna take a little bit of this minute. Do about one serving. I do not be like really measuring like that, for real, for real. Um, <clears throat> I kind of just eyeball it, y'all, like for real, for real. I just, sometimes I just be feeling like I don't have time for that. I'm go ahead. I don't like a lot of mayo, but on keto, it definitely adds some fat to your meal. So. I, I like to do like some, I just don't like a lot. Dang, I got some cheese in here, stuck in here. Oh well, I gotta clean this thing out anyways. I love my air fryer though, I promise you I do. And then, get some of this iceberg lettuce to pop on top. That's usually all I really put on my burgers, for real y'all. Like, I, I really don't have to have tomato on there. I don't have to have pickles on there. But if I was making my husband a burger, I would do pickles. And I like to smash it down a little bit. I don't know what it is. And then sometimes I like to cut it in half the opposite direction. You know what I mean? Okay. Okay, so that's that. I'm gonna take the zucchini and um, so we left with, with this melted cheese and everything. Okay. That's that. Okay, so now open it up so y'all can see. And we about to uh we're about to eat y'all. And this is dinner.
Okay. This is how we looking. Now it's Thursday and I'm just now about to do my first workout of the week. So the plan is to work out at least today, tomorrow, and then possibly Saturday, but we'll, we'll see. But a minimum at this point, seeing the fact it's already Thursday, a minimum of two days. Minimum, 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 minimum. Anyways, though, so my son actually, my son, <laughs> my husband ended up actually picking up our son from school. So I'm gonna go ahead, put on my socks and shoes, do my little hit workout. And um, I might even show you guys some of the ball exercises that I like to do. All right. We're just gonna stretch. So we're in the truck and we are on our way to the gym, to the kickboxing gym that I go to. I mean, honestly though, I haven't been there at least in a couple weeks, like maybe a few, <laughs> maybe a few weeks. So we're going to go there now and um, hopefully get us a good workout in. Last night, I did go ahead and do my uh, workout, which I believe I already have inserted in here. And um, this is the point, because it's Friday. This is, this is the day where you start to think to yourself like, I wonder what that scale gonna say tomorrow. This is the point where you should have already checked in on the scale to see like what it's gonna say tomorrow. And if you haven't, like, you start to get a little nervous about what it's going to say tomorrow because tomorrow is your official weigh-in day. But listen, y'all, I'm not even going to worry about that, okay? Like, it is what it is at this point. Okay, y'all, so we are sitting outside of the gym. My cousin Tish was supposed to meet me here, but so much for that, you know. Y'all know how it is when people don't take weight loss as serious as you. You know what I mean? Like, I should have known she wasn't coming. I should have known that girl wasn't coming. So, um, we were supposed to go grab something to eat after too, but so much for that. Well, on Friday nights, you can kind of see they do like a little in the dark with the disco lights going sort of class. So, that part is very, very cool. I like that. Like, tucked 
way in this corner over here. Okay, so here's dinner. I already ate some of that shrimp scampi. Got a little salad. It probably looked bigger on here, but it is so small. And then some broccoli. So basically, I got exactly what I was saying I was gonna get from Red Lobster. All right. Okay, zero it out. Let's go ahead and hop up on the scale. Okay guys, so let's wrap this week up. Um, as you guys can see, we didn't lose any weight this week. We ended up going up 0.4 of a pound, but honestly, like I know like I'm not I'm not that surprised though. Um because you know, like for about three or four weeks I had not been consistent with working out. I ended up working out three times this week. I ended up going to the kickboxing place twice uh, this week. I went on Friday and Saturday, and then I did one hit workout this week. So, but for about three or four weeks, I was only doing one workout a week, and that was the hit workout um, at home. So it just seems like whenever I work out consistently and I haven't been doing like consistent days um in one week it's like it's almost like I don't know if it's that I'm gaining muscle really fast or and it's like it kind of stalls the scale or adds on to the scale or something but it's something along those lines like it's like definitely where if I am starting to work out consistently my weight literally like either don't move or it moves in an upward motion so hopefully you know we're preparing for something greater either next week or the week after or something like that um i may even do a egg fast just like a three-day egg fast just to kind of um reset my body a little bit or i may not if you're interested in something like that just let me know down below and um that's really all i have like it wasn't a really hard week it wasn't really a um you know like it wasn't a bad week i mean I, like i said you know it was definitely positive for me to be able to go ahead and um uh work out consistently again because as you guys know for weeks now i've been talking about like dang i only worked out one time and i need to get back to like a regimen like you know so i was able to do that so i'm proud of myself for that um i just i can't worry about that scale point four isn't that much but when you add that on top of you're not losing at all too like you just feel a little more like a certain way about that um but like i said i'm not gonna i'm not i'm not stressed about it because i know it's only positive things for me to work out and you know maybe my body is is reconstructing like the composition of it or something like that and that's fine i'm here for that you know what i mean like i feel like that's how we're going to get to our goal where like um, we have a little more like muscle toning and stuff like that. And that's what we want. Like, I don't want to just lose the weight and, um, not really have any like muscle tone, you know what I mean? No definition to the body. Like, I just don't really like that look for me. So, uh, that's what I have this week, guys. And I hope you enjoyed it. Also, guys, like if you're not subscribed, what are you waiting on? Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It really helps me grow my channel, helps other people find this page. Um, you know, if they're looking for the same kind of content as you. And until next time, bye.